Hey players, welcome back for another video. Today, I'll be giving you all the latest news on the PS5 Pro. Now guys, before I get into the video, I really, really appreciate all of the support I've been getting recently on my channel. And I just, like, I appreciate you guys a lot. And I also have to say that the PlayStation Portal lives up to the hype that it got. I really, really love using it, especially when I'm not at home. The connection is solid and it'll be, it's, it's great fun, guys. I highly recommend getting it if you're not always at home and you want to get a little bit of a quick gaming session in. And also, you just need to make sure you have a strong connectivity, internet, and upload speed. But yeah, guys, no more talking. Let's get into all the latest news the PS5 Pro has to offer for us. Sony is reportedly working on a PlayStation 5 Pro model that will well include a far more powerful GPU that is up to three times faster than the existing PS5 models. YouTuber Moore's Law is Dead claims to have gotten access to a technical overview document for the PS5 Pro, codenamed Trinity, and now Tom Henderson at Insider Gaming reports that the leak specifications are accurate and the console is currently set to release during the holiday 2024 period. Include a mention of 67 teraflops of 16 bit floating point calculations, which works out to around 33.5 teraflops of single precision compute. That reportedly works out to a 45% rendering performance improvement over the PS5. The existing PS5 is a 10.28 teraflop console, so tripling that would be a significant performance increase on the GPU side alone. The PS5 may offer up to three times the ray tracing performance, as well as times four in some cases. The documents which were reportedly posted to Sony's own developer portal also mentions PlayStation Spectral Super Resolution PSSR. This is rumored to use PlayStation Machine Learning for image upscaling that's similar to NVIDIA DLSS or AMD's FSR. This may well include upscaling to 8K resolutions in future versions and will help improve ray tracing performance on this rumored PS5 Pro hardware. While Moore's Law is Dead hasn't always been the most reliable source for console leaks, Henderson's reporting suggests that Sony's own first-party studios have been testing PS5 Pro dev kits in September, with third parties getting access in January. Henderson's previously reported last year that a PS5 Pro is being planned with a target release date of November 2024. It sounds like Sony may well be on target to hit that ambitious time frame. So players, those are the latest news on the Sony PS5 Pro. Now guys, let me know your thoughts on these news and are you looking forward to buying this console? I sure am. I, I may have to skip out on my PS5 standard. I mean, nah, I can't really put it on the shelf already, man. I mean, I feel like I've been using it forever. I, I got that PS5 in the scalper bot days, man. Like, I remember I was spamming car at the cart for 10 minutes straight just to get my hands on one. And I honestly have a personal connection with mine. But hey, man, out with the old and in with the new. But I don't know. I'm curious to hear all of your thoughts and opinions down below. So, players, I really, really hope that you enjoyed the video. Please like comment, share, and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace out, gamers.